everybody, and welcome to another joint Let's Play adventure. This is Brandon from Brandon Walks Through. This is Stu from Pojo Poo Poo Head. Heck, Let's, yes. Yeah. Dude, and we're very excited. Super excited to be back. Like, haven't done this in so long. This is a very rare occurrence. We're just going to let this video play real quick. Yeah. Do you think they named them Banjo and Kazooie just so they could give him a Banjo and Kazooie a Kazooie? I don't know where they came up with the names. I'm sure there's answers on the internet somewhere, whether they're right or wrong. Rocking out. Dude, I rock this. Rock this one. Is this song? You just listen, listen to it? Oh. <laughs> His nose was all weirdly <laughs> floppy there a second ago when he was like head banging to his own song. What's his sister's name? I'm Tui. I'm Tui? Yeah. Hence the banjo. Hence the second name? I'm pretty sure. I didn't know it was Tui. Yeah, it's Tui. Mm, we're gonna we're no, we're gonna see it in a second. Remember she's gonna get, you know yeah. what's gonna happen. I'm not gonna ruin anything for you. Oh, well, yeah. you guys know something's gonna happen. Ooh <laughs> plot line. Oh my gosh, so yeah. Something has to develop. Yeah, dude, so Banjo Kazooie. Epic game. Nineteen ninety eight, man. I was I was so young. But yeah, it's a great game. And we're gonna be doing this, so we're gonna hopefully get a lot of video recorded get a lot of videos posted really quickly since we both are very busy well we just don't yeah it'll, it'll be over a couple months span yeah uh, but we're gonna make this a priority so we're for sure gonna yeah we're gonna get all these this completely finished at least and then uh, you know i mean we'll get you know a lot of gameplay you know and then footage will be released you know as we get things finalized 2D. which will be fun 2D. i guess it's 2d not or two toot like you're farting with a y <laughs> 2d 2d and then let's see. Okay, yeah, it, yeah. I guess that's it's totally mumbo. Yeah. You're right. Oh yeah. Mumbo okay. Token. Yeah. Um. Yes. Yeah, so we'll we'll get this out. I do a lot better than what I've been doing on my personal channel. <laughs> mm -hmm. Been slacking, but I like Stu's been saying we, we've been really busy uh, with stuff. Who isn't? Who needs time anymore? Uh, but <laughs> who we does figured things. We'd, uh, we'd show the intro video and kind of talk about when we got Banjo-Kazooie or just any, like, early memories of it. So, mm -hmm. I know for me, it was one of those things where you go to, um, uh, it, you go to the store and pick out your game. That was for you, but for, I guess for me, I'm trying to remember, I, my squeaky grandma got it. Uh, that's my grandma from my dad's side, uh, for me, not for my birthday, because that's all, always what she would get is a, a Nintendo game for me, which was perfect. Um, and this was one of them. And I didn't really know what it was. Uh, and we turned it on, and I loved it. I, I played the crap out of it. I got everything in it, all the jiggies, all everything. Um... And it's it, pretty simple story. Yeah, I just loved it. I don't, I don't know. Um, but what about you? What There's nothing wrong with that. No, no, mine, mine's in the similar vein. It's a, it's a little different though. Every when I was when I was a kid, every summer, my mom's mother, my grandma, Grambo is her nickname. Uh, Rambo related, yes, but that's a whole other story. I'm not going to go into right now. So we go and we all have a week with Grambo during the summer. Me and all my siblings. So at the end of the week, then you'd go to the mall that was near our house, and we get to walk around. And of course, I'm a kid. I'm a young, you know, boy who wants to go to the toy store. So you go to old KB Toys, which yeah. it might exist somewhere. I don't know if they even are around anymore. But we go there. And you get to pick out anything that you wanted, like one toy. So, of course, uh, when I went, we went to KB Toys, and I had never heard of this game. I was looking at the big wall, and they had all the N64 boxes in a giant rectangle for the new releases, you know, by with tape on the back in, like, nice square patterns. And I saw Banjo-Kazooie there, and I had no idea what it was, but it was colorful, you know? They took Rareware totally did it, and they totally appealed to my taste as a child who likes furry animals, I guess. And totally wanted, wanted it and bought it and took it home then after visiting my grandma and 
played the shit out of it. I got a bunch of shit from my brother being like, what the fuck is this game? It, you don't even know what the hell you're doing it. He actually really enjoyed it too, because he started <laughs> playing it then. And it was just a sweet-ass adventure game. A super collect-a-fest. And I love collect-a-fests. Yeah, like, platformers. platformer. They, they're kind of the death of me, because I just... You want to get everything. And luckily, Banjo-Kazooie is a, a completionist. Exactly. Banjo-Kazooie, luckily, though, is a... Uh, it's a completionist dream because it's not too much and you, it's manageable. It's a manageable completionist, is right. a good way to put it. It's yeah. not it's not gonna take you years to do like with you know, all these open world RPGs, Crazy. Skyrim, yeah. World right. Warcraft, like and endless type games like that. Right. So, and you I have mean, to just, play it multiple times, just get different dialogues right. and stuff. And this this yeah. game too was a little more manageable in the aspect of uh like you didn't have to constantly go back like get something from a future level, go back to it and uh deal with it cut, or, or spend a bunch of time just trying to figure out like yeah. how why why can't I get this right now and mm -hmm. you realize later like oh it's because I don't have that ability yet yeah but yeah. it's a one and done it's a one and done game you go into a level you can get everything on your first run as long as you are good enough and you just you want to keep playing it you can find everything it just takes you a little time to go through the entire area and find all the little nuances and sure. uh, like yeah. the new moves and things that you need but that's what banjo Tui I feel really failed because I really was disappointed with banjo Tui's level well neat level design neat ideas but just poor execution with um, a lot of the gameplay elements and that's a whole other yeah I topic think it was just I'm leftover <laughs> stuff from like the development of this game it that they, they, but... fit, they fit in you know, to that one, but they just kind of fell short a little bit. But yeah, I, I mean, but I still the enjoyed it, but like it I didn't enjoy it as much as this one. This one was Agreed. really Agreed. Uh, crafted. It was really perfect and stuff. But Stu brought up uh, something during his story that I wanted to mention. This is going to be a mature recording of the game. We figured this is going to be, um, since this is more retro game now, that's yeah. kind of weird but to you, say but, that. But you totally didn't do it. what we planned. You totally know, didn't say totally that this forgot. was going to be... Well, I mean, I said like ass a second ago. <laughs> yeah. Like, come on, kids. Like, I'm pretty sure that's like an acceptable word on television. Now, right. Anyway. anyway. Right. But still, yes, it's going to be a mature recording. Brandon was supposed to pretend like, all right, this is going to be a kid-friendly <laughs> game, so it's going to be a kid-friendly recording. Right. And I was going to be like, no, fuck you, Brandon. <laughs> we are adults playing an old video game. This is a nostalgia <laughs> trip. A straight up nostalgia trip. And Banjo falls and dies. Whoever played that yeah. sucked balls. Dude, he totally did. He, all he had to do was jump and yeah, you know, right. flap a little bit. Right. He's been I think fine. He's, he's not good. And he just <laughs> flops right there, too. <laughs> um, but yeah, so it's Dude, they so told, didn't they parental take... advisory. Whatever. Yeah, yeah. They totally took that hand, though, from... From like Zelda, didn't they? Almost, almost like a wall, a wall hang, a wall creeper, or the wall drop. Which came out first, Zelda? Oh, Zelda, probably. Did. Yeah, yeah, they had the, they had the wall creeper guys in the original Legend yeah. of Zelda. They'd come up from the side and be like, like yeah, they're similar. Made yeah. some made some this is more noise and move that you obviously can't see because you can only hear my voice. <laughs> but yes, yeah, so yeah, so we're um, definitely looking forward to hopefully entertaining you. Hopefully you enjoy it. We'll give you, of course, our tips and tricks and right. things we can remember. Um, like a lot of things that I play, like I'm more apt to know the beginning of things a lot better than the ending. So, you know, the first areas in the game I'm going to be super familiar with. I remember a lot of stuff. But as we progress, and I'm sure this will probably be the same for Brandon, we're probably going to get lost and we'll be like, wait, what are we doing here? Yeah, it's, it's, it's pretty straightforward overall. But as a kid, this game was very daunting. Like right. Brandon mentioned he beat it. And got everything. I'll I never, show you that. I never did too. as a kid, I actually. I I got really far, actually, to one of the last levels, but I actually didn't complete the whole game. Mm -hmm. It wasn't until years later that I actually revisited it and went and got everything and did everything. And it was a lot of fun doing that then when I did. And then following that, that's also when I wanted to try out Banjo-Tooie, which I was very disappointed with just a lot of the game mechanics. The levels were cool, it was neat ideas, but they were just poorly executed, I feel, within the design of the game. So, this game, just a much better flow to it, and the backtracking thing, what Brandon mentioned earlier, you don't, you don't have to be like, oh, I can't get this because I don't have a move, because there was no indication that you needed a certain type of move to right. get there. You just had to figure it out later in the game, which made you run all the way back to this area that was like took forever to get back to half the time just to get the one little item that you missed because you couldn't get it on that particular time. Yeah, and what I wanted to add, too, is that the last time I played this was literally when I was a kid, so I was eight years old. Um, so I'm going to forget a few things for sure, but I think we're, we're good enough gamers to still, like... Yeah, things uh, are going to come back. Yeah, sure. exactly. And that I, and yeah. uh, we can also just kind of relive the wonder just because it's been so long. We've gotten to forget something. Or we have... 
gotten to forget some of the stuff that... Uh, and it's going to take us back. It's right, It's going to totally exactly. take us back, and we'll, we'll remember everything as they as it comes along or certain instances. And, but yeah, we, anything that we remember, we'll give you insights on tips or tricks that we can think of, yada yada, so on and so forth. Just a fun hanging out, playing games, right. and um, you know, hopefully we'll help you if you're stuck or um, if you just enjoy watching Let's Plays, because obviously this is a huge phenomenon now with Twitch and everything, so right. we're still sticking to YouTube just because, obviously these old games, you can't... Oh, you can do these on the computer on Twitch, that's true. Yeah, but... but... I mean, we like doing the co-op. I mean, you, they even have co-ops, though. I mean, I don't know. Co- co-op's kind of more of a YouTube thing than a Twitch thing, I think, so. Twitch, I think, is still... Yeah. Well, they do tournaments, but it depends. Yeah. Anyway. Either way. Phenomenas. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay. All right. Hope yeah. you guys enjoy. Yeah. Enjoy the video. We're gonna... Yeah, next video, we'll definitely be starting up and playing through the whole entire game, so... <laughs> All in one video. <laughs> <laughs> Not in one video. But, yes. So, suffice to say.